now hear this. Repair teams 4 through 7 are cleared to depart through airlock 12. Bridge refit is now complete. Departure stations in one hour. Senior officers report to pre-launch briefing at the Admiral's ready room in 15 minutes. Bring cheesecake. That is all. I've been looking for you over, Mr. O'Reilly. Blimey, this hasn't been clean since the Borg invasion. Sorry, sir, I'll just... It's fine, it's fine. At ease. I just want to acknowledge that Mitchell Stone was your friend. I'm sorry for my part in what happened to him. He's a loss to us all. I just wish there was some way we could restore him, to make him human again. It's kind of tricky for us to know how far his assimilation has gone, or if he's truly Mitchell anymore. He said that this future is all that's left for us, and it's really hitting me now. It's not easy to accept. But you can play a role in this future, Graham. What can I do here? Well, now that Admiral Hocking has provisionally put me back in command, I need a new chief. You've been training and engineering, overseeing these repairs, and judging by the fact you've been looking at these blueprints, you know at least as much about this ship as Mitchell. Do you, do you think I'll be ready for something like that? Maybe it's time we found out. What do you say? Come on. We've got a space station to recapture, if we survive. Admiral's log. There's an old Latin phrase, tabula rasa, meaning to start a clean slate. That's what today feels like. We still have our quest to take back Unity and a returning Borg threat, but now the Odyssey has received extensive retrofits and new crew members to replace those sent away, there is a definite sense of renewal on board since the inquiry. Our next mission, now direct from Starfleet Command, is to induct planet Rakellus into the Federation. I realise that all good things will come to an end, so for as long as we're all together on this ship, exploring the final frontier, we're going to save the galaxy one more time.